Hey guys, God bless. JWE here, Revelation News. Um, so I'm calling this um, Men of the GDC. It's time to stand up. Okay? Apparently... We have a rapist in our midst. And the name starts with a G. And we now have, it appears we have two women now, at least, coming out. And saying that this stuff has happened to them with this particular individual. And you know who I'm talking about. Now, I don't want to go too far because we don't have police stuff. We don't have, you know, it's a sensitive thing. You don't want to go crazy with accusations and such. Uh, when, you know, I what I'm calling for at this point, and, uh, I think it's elementary with the situation that we have because there is another member a beloved member of the great debate community that gets along with everybody and I'm not even gonna come close to giving you that name but uh, let's just say she's she is absolutely everybody gets along with her and I've heard through the through the grapevine that there there are more women there are more and that's no pun intended so there there's the name for you there's no more <laughs> okay i'm not gonna i'm that's as far as i'm going with the name okay yeah palm malls are back palm malls are back hundreds yeah so i am calling on the men of, G of, of the great debate community to stand up for the women because if the men aren't going to stand up, what what do we expect other women to stand up for the women? No way, man. Mm -mm. I'm a Christian man. I believe that women need to be defended by their men. That's what I believe. And I think uh, the majority of the secular community will agree with me, too. Maybe not the MGTOWs, because <laughs> they, well, they got their deal. I don't know what that is been hurt by too many women but um you know who it is just by what i've said here you know who i'm talking about you know and and god bless you hannah god bless you uh that other name that starts with an r i won't go there because she's a female that 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 this has been bantied around about uh the possibility but she's, she has an emotional thing, you know, bless her heart, that she doesn't want to deal with it. So I'm not, I'm going to act like I didn't even say that. I, I you know, that name I won't, uh -uh, I'm not going there because she's, she's fragile. She's a fragile girl, bless her heart. So I, I'm calling on all of us, all of us men in the community I mean, especially the ones that are really vocal and out there, like like Dragnaut. I, I mean, I think it's time, bro. And I'll call you brother. I'm I'm a dragoon. <sighs> uh, it, it's time it's time to start calling this stuff out. And it doesn't. It's not just for this guy. We had a child molesting scumbag in our midst for years. In Matt Bell. And you know what? This might be a good opportunity for me to address said person with the Matt Bell stuff, too. Dude, you keep saying you're not defending a child molester, but the way you talk about it, it almost is like you're defending child molestation. It's very disturbing. You need to start Gee, you need to start praying, dude. Like, like I love you and all, but you, uh, you I, something's going on with you, and, and you need prayer, and you need to start praying, dude. I, and and now this stuff coming out, you have, 
I don't know. It's like... The last time I, I was in contact with Shannon, she was like, I, I, I'm not going to trust anybody from the internet anymore. Like, at all. And I don't blame her. I, I mean, it's... It's messed up. I mean, I, I, I had an inkling that Bell was sort of a creepy dude, you know? Like, he would sit around in his bathrobe. He will look at me with no shirt on doing a video, but he had a vibe about him. I'm, the reason I had my shirt off is because it's, it's absolutely scorching hot in Colorado, man. It's crazy. Um... I knew he I, he gave me a creepo vibe for sure, but but uh, children never. I wouldn't think. I mean, the way he talked about justice and law and order, I, it's the last thing I would think that he would say. He'd be a fucking child. Excuse me. Uh, he'd be a freaking child molester. The uh, no, nah. I saw him hit on like sugar and. Uh, some of the females, I think he even hit on Shannon a little bit, uh, but never a child molester. That's what I'm saying. That, like it's very disturbing. Some of the things you find out in the community, it's it's messed up. But now you have you have multiple, you have multiple women saying that something's not right here. And another one that I can't, I won't give you the name, but she's a sweetheart in the community, and she wouldn't lie about this stuff. All right, so if we're not going to stand up and be men, then this could it could keep happening. I mean, gee, with with these, you could they could even just be rumors with no substantiation whatsoever. I don't. It doesn't matter. Do you think anybody's going to want to be at a meetup with you with this stuff be going around like this? You know. So. That's my stance. I'm calling this. Men of the GDC, stand up. You know, we. it appears we might have a rapist in our midst. We had a child molester for years. So let's stand up. Let's, let's be men. Let's not let this stand, right? Praise Jesus. That's my stance. So, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Jason William E. Groff, Revelation News. Talk to you later. Bye.